I watch pornography before I meet my wife. Huh? Pornography. Rosie. When a man in his 30s is he's following an 18 year old or 20 year old kid, should I tell you what they're looking for? Women, are you with me? They are looking for somebody they can control. Somebody they would say, sit down there. I sit there. Somebody they will say, don't go there. Somebody they will say, don't do this. Somebody they would, you know, someone they can entice and control. Someone they can instill fair in. That's why they would never date these Gen Z buddies. That's why they would never date women in their age group. And that's why some of them cannot even date older women. Because you cannot control someone who has everything. Who literally just want a companion. Men. Some of them treat you like they own you. This is this pornography thing that I mentioned. It is so annoying. I watched an interview. And then they ask this man what the problem was. He said the woman is always complaining. With the way he's treating her in bed. I said, okay, why don't you treat your wife better and ask her how she wants it? The man went ahead saying, I treat her the best way possible. How do you know that? I watch pornography before I meet my wife. Uh -huh. Pornography. Rosie. Pornography, really? Seriously now? I don't want to take too long on this matter, guys. I know we have so much to say about men. I know men also have a lot to say about women. And I also need to finish this in my routine. But guys, don't play. Don't play. Like, how, how can you just look at a woman? And say you watch pornography before you meet your wife, not even your baby. Do you know what is happening on the app? Do you know what happens when people so pornography does not teach sex? Pornography teaches you how to disrespect women. Do you know what they teach you? They teach you to spit at women, they teach you to make another woman to sleep with another woman, and you watch them. They teach you to record women having sex with you, they teach you to eat women all in the name of sex, they teach you to disrespect women. And then you say you learn how to have sex from such place. How cruel. And then you do that to your wife. Do you know what pornography does to you? Men, come close. Do you know what pornography does to you? Pornography makes you emotionally unavailable. You you don't make love. You don't meet your other half in in the right state. You're just going to to re to replay the lessons you have learned from two individuals who are simply doing their job. They are professionals. That's not how they'll do it on a good day with their own other house. So you think these ones are the ones that are going to help you. Huh? Oh, cool. You that want peace. You that want respect. I want to challenge you today. Everything you say you want in a woman. Uncle, oh, I want to challenge you today. That thing that you said you want in a woman. Do it for your woman. Just one month straight up. Okay? Don't expect anything in return. Don't command respect this time around. Hold your tongue. Hold your you go hold everything just one month challenge i'm not talking about this girlfriend boyfriend i do on the side i'm talking about your other wife your fiances your wife mm? and maybe at least somebody you know you want to settle down somebody you want to spend the rest of your life with do these things with them all right do it for them without expecting anything in return it's that respect you want bro you will earn it spoil a woman and she's ready to double that standard she would raise that bar Except now you except say they date goat child because as goat day for men, night day for women. Except say you they date go to if you know date goat, if you they get premium babe like us. If, like, see, I am being serious. There are men out there are women out there who definitely knows what this love thing means. No, no, they attract rubbish. You will hear a man saying, Oh, I, I love this kind of men. I love that I, mean, I love this kind of women. I love that type of women, blah blah blah. But you see them end up with the opposite of what they say they want. Like, I, I don't understand. You, you, Some men don't even know what they want. They are confused as hell. They just want to use their listing to be. They're stopping everywhere. So if that's the case, leave women alone now. Why are you? Why are you? That's like women. Like, the craziest ones, though, they would upset you. Yeah? They will be the ones to wrong that woman. And they will still be, be upset. They will be angry at her for reacting. Guys, there is no reaction without a prior action. Stop asking for what you cannot offer. You want peace, but you cannot offer peace. <laughs> you want respect, but you cannot give respect. You don't love your woman enough, and you want her to love you. Oh, more than enough this time. Men, nothing do better. You guys can do better. You can do better. And women, 
In 2023, you believe men. You believe men. Huh. Anyways, signing out now. So before I leave, if you have not subscribed to this channel, if you're just joining us for the first time, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and try to always come back. And however, in the comments below, let me know your thoughts. The things that you know that men do to women that are so mean and they cannot take half of it. I'd like for us to share in the comment section. And men, I know you guys, you lots have experienced shakies from women. Also share your opinions in the comment section. You never can tell. You might just meet the other half there. Sometimes, from the way they type, from their comment, you shall know them. I said, let me tell you, me, I will still trust man because I want to settle down. Mm. But the best of them is what I'll get. So affirm yours, claim yours, look before you leap. Stop dating goats. Mm -hmm.